What's up everybody? This is SC Survival and Hunting here and we're coming at you today with another video. Huh, you haven't heard that quote in a while now have you? The last time we used that quote was like our first video so I don't know why we said I'm coming at you today with another video since that was our first video but I'm gonna tell you why. Because we filmed our bug out bag video but the stupid camera wouldn't upload it so we just had to start over and we had already filmed that so we just used that. But anyway as I got off on that tangent Today we're doing the tabletop review of the Schrade, as you can tell by the name, it's spelled right there for you, Schrade, S-C-H Bolo, otherwise known as the Bolo Machete. So, we ordered this off of Amazon for, I believe it was, it was $44.99, so $45. Bucks. Now, from the Schrade Taylor Brands website, it is $68. Now, I would... Depending on what I want to buy, I mean, I would want to go towards the Amazon price, but Schrade is just a great company. They have great customer support, so I would go through them, but on this one, I actually bought it off of Amazon. <clears throat> Alright, so right out of the box, get the standard box. Before I get into all the blade stuff, let me find the warranty. This says, do not kill any unarmed people, right here. Now I'm seeing this is just the... Standard warranty. I think this is. Let me check real quick. I don't think this is a lifetime warranty. Sorry, guys, for the pause, real quick. I'm looking for it. Limited lifetime warranty. But it doesn't say how many years. Oh, it's basically lifetime warranty as in, it's limited lifetime warranty, full warranty to the person who bought it. So if I bought it, and I break it, I get a new one until the day I die, okay? But say if I buy it, and my friend over there uses it and breaks it, it won't get covered, because I wasn't the one using it. Do you see what I mean? That's how it's limited lifetime warranty. All right. Now we have the awesome sheath right here. It has the huge strap where you can put it on your back. And it has the little small pouch right here that has a ferro rod right in it. And then uh, this is a medium, I believe this is a medium diamond stone sharpener. And this is awesome so you have the ability to sharpen your knife while you're out in the woods if you're hunting with it or chopping down trees. But then you have the ability to start a fire at your shelter. Oh, excuse me there, at your shelter. So there you can potentially have, with your sharpness, you can make shelter, you can have fire, you can have animals to eat, you, you have protection, you have just tons of ways. And this, uh, I, this is a pretty, pretty decent little sheath. It's a uh, nylon. You have a little open strap right here. It says open, obviously. There's two right here, and you just slide the knife right in. And I'll get back to that in a second. All right, so the Shred Bolo Machete comes with a little cardboard cover right here. Magic, a blade just appeared. You have the Shred Bolo. It's just regular stainless. It's 3CR13 stainless steel. It has a, I believe this one is a titanium coating. Yeah, titanium finish, full tang. So the blade metal runs from tip to butt. It has a nice rubber overmold handle, which is what I really like. It's real comfortable. It has a, just a regular cord <coughs> lanyard right here. So whenever you're slashing, you have... It's just, just helped to get there so it never slides out on you. It's quite thick right there. I believe that's 3 8 inch thick. It has the SCH Bolo right there. It came decently machete style sharp. The weird thing is, the blade curves up and then goes down. So it's extremely top heavy. So if you're slashing something, you don't have to put a lot of force into it. You could just go like that and it'll chop. You don't have to go wasting a whole bunch of energy like that. I'm gonna read off some more facts. It's, it's uh, the blade length is 14 inches or 35 and a half centimeters. The handle length is 7.3 inches or 18.5 inches, 
The overall length is 21.3 inches or 54 centimeters and the weight is 1.69 pounds. Yes, this is a pretty heavy 20 inch machete. Usually 20 inch machetes aren't this heavy because the Gerber Gator Machete Junior, that's 20 inches but it's what, uh, a half a pound maybe? It's light. This thing just has tons of metal. Well, as in, it's thick, full tang, and it's just heavy duty. All right, so here. To put it in the sheath, you just go just like that until it won't go anymore. And then, this is weird right here. I'm trying to figure this out. It's acting weird on me. There we go. <clears throat> trying to think how this it does it hasn't been working good lately you have to like twist it for it to work around the knife like that you have to twist it like that for it to go over for it to stay secure then you close both of those tabs right there so you just have standard nylon strap with two little buttons button ups right there external pouch like I just said it's removable removable just go to the back just like this then there's velcro take it right off and then if you want to there's a little loop right here for you to put it on something now this obviously that right there isn't gonna be a belt loop you know how awkward that would be if you can get that well look how weird that would be having it like that all right and then you know just to put it right back on just pop it on the velcro but look it can't be crooked y'all you can do something do it right and it's crooked Snap it right back on. And so far, these straps right here, uh, they could be a little bit better construction, but I mean, they're just small straps that, if it breaks, they're still Velcro, but it feels good. It has their name on here. It has a name on the handle, and has these straps right here to, stra to put it on your back so you could keep it on your side. Well, it goes on your back so it hangs over on your side, and then whenever you want to put it on your belt, you have straps right here to keep it to your knee or attach it to your leg so it doesn't flop back and forth. so after you saw those pictures and kind of how it goes on your person that's about it for this uh, tabletop review we will have a review of this uh, chopping logs bushcrafting batoning different things like that to see kind of how it performs how well it will uh, throw a spark is honestly I don't like that striker right there for that so it's it's a bit difficult to use that all right, so after you saw that, that's, this is about it for this video. Please, I, l I like this machete. Go check it out. I've done a little bit of testing with it. Remember, 45 bucks on Amazon, 68 bucks on the Shrey website. So, guys, this is SC Survival and Hunting. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and share. Don't forget about sharing. If you like this channel, why don't you tell other people about it so they can like it too, and we can all live happily ever after. But not together, obviously, because... This is over the internet. So go check out Shrade. I'll put a link to Taylor Brands in the description. I'll put a link to Amazon in the description. And check out our one-year anniversary on YouTube giveaway that's going on right now. It ends August 31st, so get entered while you can. And so thanks for watching, guys. SC Survival and Hunting. I'm out.